India to up to all other countries. The cashmere consumption is rational. The specific crops. And we have the problem to address the existing in Meghalaya system as well as I would like to emphasize the Meghalaya cashews. Here the significant of organic cashew nut which has the essential fatty acid high than other amino acid composition is high than others and also naturally grow. No plantation activities is involved. That is the beauty of this class. So, this program is mainly addressing the problem where the Meghalaya cashew net, this 1,500 metric tons is equivalent of nearly 5 lakh metric tons of the coal over the India. It has a distinct unique of this Meghalaya cashew net. And all the members of our cooperative of cashew net societies and dear students and ladies and gentlemen, uh, it is a great day for our uh, campus that we are organizing the International Day of uh, Cashew uh, first time. And uh, for the outset, I congratulate the Department of Agribusiness and Food Technology as well as uh, Dr. Shish Kumar for uh, initiating to organize this uh, program where uh, it is being sponsored by Almeida and Africa Asia and our Nehu. Uh, see, this uh, we have uh, agribusiness department and food technology, and then uh, we have innovation center, which is uh, sponsored by MSME as well as uh, ICR uh, Raipur. So this uh, innovation center has been uh, carrying out a number of activities uh, as far as uh, livelihood is concerned, especially in agriculture. Uh, area of production and development. First of all, I'd like to say that on this program, we have with us the people who are experts and professionals uh, and who will share their expertise. Having welcomed our Honorable Vice Chancellor, who has been the motivating force behind every benchmark which Tura campus has achieved and I would like to put that on record. It is this motivation which has really guided us and guided every faculty, every non-teaching and guided the vision of this campus. Brazil. From Brazil to India out came and who introduced in India? The Portuguese introduced Casio in our country. And then who, who introduced the Casio in the northeastern part of the country? As our Atari director rightly pointed out that Cassie that is known a poor man crop or poor man cow, whatever, an academician we can define it, and rich man food. But I can say that the government of India, with the help of Assam government, introduced this crop in the northeastern part of the country to save the soil. <laughs> this area is an unlimited area. That's why the government of India, under the soil conservation program, introduced Ketchu in the part of the Meghalaya. And Meghalaya, West and South Garo Hills, as I remember my campus director, rightly pointed out to be see have the experience of this area more than, uh, see have more than 30 
he had experience of this area. But at this time, our farmers are living from the cultivation of the cashew and also not getting the remunerative price, facing some other problems. Someone even uh, kept in my knowledge more than 12 cashew processing units established by the government in different parts of the uh, Garohits in Meghalaya. But out of that only one or two are working. So being an academic institution, this is our duty to find out the problems of our problems of the farmers and also to find out the gap. Where is the gap? The uh, Nehru Tura campus already has three important departments. Food, we have already the food technology department. We have the horticulture department. And also, we have the agri business department. And as I remember, I can throw that away in the documents. The farmers of the Tura area, Garo and South Hulls, South Hill, facing three main important problems. The one is the quality planting material. The Department of Horticulture can play an important role in this area. And the farmers are producing only two varieties, and that is a very old varieties. One is cashew. One is Ben Kurula and another is Ulla. I am right? Two varieties. And both varieties are kept from the Goa and Karnataka. Goa and Karnataka pupils are producing this variety. And uh, research centers are there, can play an important role to test some varieties in the area of the south and the west. And accordingly, they can manage with the coordination of the research centers or they can also develop a nursery with the help of the state government as well as the Nabad. And Atari can also help us to develop a nursery in this area for the benefit of our farmers. Another thing is processing and marketing. We already have the marketing departments. Our students are doing the degree agri business management. And as I know, all the cashew growers are producing the cashew in organic farms. We can plant it. And the Nehu Pura campus already doing the work in this area, not for the promotion of the cashew, but for the promotion of the turmeric and the honey. And two things is already going on. So we can also involve the local farmers for the promotion, for the marketing, of the cashew. And I hope someone asks cashew through the internet. If they will be ready to work in this area, definitely I can say in future we will be very uh, helpful to the farmers or producers of the West and South Garoids. Campus of the Nehu and the farmers of the both areas, either Garo or the, uh, South Garo or the West Garoids. So I would like to even instruct and also request to the campus director, Nehu Dura campus, kindly initiate Make a small group or constitute a committee.
Committee said to them in both the areas, South Garo and the Delta, North Garo, to study the problems of our farmers. Definitely, if you are in position to be first study the problems, definitely with the discussion, Nehusura campus will be in position to find out the solutions. To find out the solution in the farm of the marketing, to find out the solution in the mark of the transportation, to find out the solution like the key marketing of the produce, to find out the solution in the farm of the good packaging, to find out the solution in the farm of the storage of their product, to find out the solution in the form of the processing of their product and we can also involve our student and we can even give some task to final year student of academic management for their practical orientation if they are even thinking or uh, uh, going to take an initiative to work in this area, definitely I can say that within the year, we will be in the position to say this is our contribution of Nehru Pura Campus. I will have glory to the Almighty uh, for making today's occasion a, a resulting success. I would like to take this opportunity to express my deepest sense of gratitude to our Vice Chancellor, Professor Shukla, for attending this program as a chief guest and on the busiest schedule to grace this occasion. Thank you, sir. I would also like to take this opportunity to express my deepest sense of gratitude to Madam Professor Sujata Gurudev. Under whose leadership the part of it, the campus uh, has been growing exponentially, which I appreciate your kind presence, madam. Thank you. And also, I'd like to uh, express my gratitude to our well wisher of the department, Dr. G. Kadirvel, uh, Director ICR Bhati, who have uh, delivered the most important keynote address for today's program and also have also highlighted uh, how different dynamics and uh, changes can be brought to this important cash crop which is cashew which we all are celebrating today. I would also like to thank uh, uh, Professor G. Singhaya Dean School of Economics Management and Information Sciences under whose leadership right now the department is and also um, his support has been unwavering all throughout ever since he was a former uh, he was a former provider and uh, I'm very thankful for you sir for your unrelentless uh, effort and support that you have bestowed to the department and also like to thank uh, uh, the sponsors for this event and the partners, APIDA, uh, Ministry of Commerce and Industries, and MSME, also for the support for those organizing this uh, celebration of International Day of Cashew. Um, I would also like to express my deepest sense of gratitude to all the professors, head of the departments, and all the faculties of different departments, and uh, also for my department. Uh, for coming and uh, giving your support and encouragement which we feel very motivated to be celebrating and also I, will, uh, I also uh, believe that everybody will be happy to be celebrating this important uh, day with all of us and also uh, give your valuable inputs in the technical sessions that we will be uh, delivering after this inaugural program. I would also like to thank all the collaborators, farmers, uh, the agencies from the government of Meghalaya for motivating our farmers. I can see Mr. 
Kalinda Hebron. Thank you so much for your uh, mobilization for doing different farmers and uh, collaborators and different uh, stakeholders who are very much part of this important cash crop. Maybe I'll do some content your program where they can be seen from the Hani Khan, Manda Padikan Khan Kenya, or Hadumina, and a tournament, I'm sorry, in Kanamcha event, Asuna, Kanamcha, Mambatani, Mantabani, my own as a Shirani, or my own as a Mantabani, Palanichi, but we have managed here to come to knowledge here from my game. Mantabas from the game, they should have to carry you or process any more, even a Adon Swinger, so we are the Kanto, the Vaipo, the Innovation Jamano, so we are technical sessions on the microphone of this and even the one of this. But also, we are not teaching here for the common sense of the one who is not supposed to have the teaching as well. Oh, uh, I'm not. 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 I'm